So let's start by tuning in to that little voice going on in between your ears. That little voice going around in circles, trying to find the answers, trying to find the solutions, going round and round. What's gonna happen? Am I doing it right? Will it work for me? What if I can't let go? Tune into it and slowly start visualizing it moving down your spine. Still going around in circles, but that's okay. Getting quieter and quieter, more and more distant, moving all the way down until finally reaching the base of your spine. And we're gonna lock in that position. You're now thinking from there, breathing from there. You can visualize your nose being down there, your ears being down there. You're out of your head, grounded at the base of your spine. And from this position, we're going to do three grounding breathing cycles where you're going to inhale for the count of six, hold for three, exhale for the count of six, and hold for three again from the base of your spine. Your nose is down there, visualize it now. And from the base of your spine, inhale for the count of six. One, two, three, four, five, six, hold for three, two, three, exhale for six, two, three, four, five, six, hold for three again, and breathe normally. Getting out of your head, getting into your body, becoming more aware, more connected. And let's get ready for a second grounding breathing cycle from the base of your spine. Inhale now. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold for three. Exhale for six. Two, three, four, five, six. Hold for three again. And breathe normally. Getting more in touch with that inner world. More connected, more aware. Feeling what's going on inside completely. And let's get ready for a third grounding breathing cycle from the base of your spine. Inhale now. One, two, three, four, five, six, hold for three, let it go, two, three, four, five, six, hold for three again, and breathe normally. You're now out of your head, grounded at the base of your spine, connected within. And what I want you to do now is to shift your awareness to the different sensations that surface around the need for approval. What comes up? And just welcome any and all sensations around this. The need for approval. The need for validation. The need for acceptance, recognition. What comes up? What are all the different ways you try to seek approval? Acting a certain way, dressing a certain way, presenting yourself a certain way. What are all the different ways? If I talk like this, I'll get approval. If I accomplish this, I'll get approval. If I make this money, I'll get approval. If I travel here, if people see this, how does this run you in your life? The need for approval. How are you a slave to this? All the effort, the worry. What if people disapprove of me? What if I don't get the recognition, the acceptance? What comes up? And go into this, the fear of being disapproved of. What does that say about you? Getting disapproved of, getting judged. If 
I don't get the approval, maybe I'm not good enough, maybe I'm not worthy, maybe I don't have what it takes, maybe I'm not lovable, maybe something's wrong with me, what comes up? And what comes up when you hear me ask you, can you let go of this right here, right now? The need for approval and the fear of being disapproved of, can you let go? of being run by this, the heaviness, the paranoia, the worry. Can you free yourself from this right here, right now? Is there any resistance to letting go of this? Welcome the sensations and let's get ready for a cycle here, opening ourselves up, letting them take over, surrendering completely now, tune into it and inhale for six. One, two, three, four, five, six, hold for three, let it go, two, three, four, five, six, hold for three again, and breathe normally. And let's go even deeper here. What about the need for control? What are all the different ways you're trying to control? Trying to control life, to go a certain way. I need this to happen. I don't want that to happen. I want this to happen. The heaviness. Trying to control others. How people see you, what they think of you. Trying to control loved ones. or trying to control yourself, trying to control how you feel, how you think, how you are? Are you trying to control yourself even right now in this moment? Trying to control how you let go? How are you run by this? And once underneath that need for control, what happens if you let go? Do you trust yourself? If I don't control, well then what? What happens if you don't control? The need for control and the lack of trust. Trusting that things will go your way. Trusting that you have your best interests at heart. Can you trust that without interfering, trying to control? Can you trust yourself? Is there any resistance or fear around trusting yourself? Welcome to sensations. And let's get ready for another cycle here. Any and all sensations around the need for control. Can you let go of this now? Inhale for six. One, two, three, four, five, six, hold for three, let it go, two, three, four, five, six, hold for three again, and breathe normally. And what about the need for safety and security? Do you feel safe within? When did you lose that? Allow yourself to feel what comes up. Don't stuff it down. When did you stop feeling safe within yourself? When did you lose that feeling of belonging where you can just be? And that is all. When did all the requirements kick in? I can only be at peace if, I can only be myself if, just the heaviness, the pressure. When did you lose that? When was being you not good enough? And once more, do you feel safe and secure within yourself? And how might this manifest externally, the need for safety and security? I must protect myself. I need this, I need that, approval, control, money, success, friends, or else. 
relationship or else. When did you start getting run by this fear and scarcity? And when did you start running away from you? And is there any resistance to being you right now in this moment? Tune into that. Needing to feel differently, to be differently. I need to change how I feel. I need to feel better. I need to be better. I need to be more. I need to do more. That force pulling you away from you. Saying, this isn't good enough. I am not good enough. What sensations? And go even deeper here. What about the self-attack that comes with that? Can you let go of being so cruel to yourself? So mean? Beating yourself down, insulting yourself? What would it feel like to just let go and be more loving, compassionate, and embracing? Welcome the sensations, and let's get ready for another cycle, a big one. The need for security, the resistance to being you, the self-attack. Can you let go of this right here, right now? Inhale for six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold for three. Let it go. Two, three. Four, five, six. Hold for three again. And breathe normally. <sighs> and seeing yourself right now in this moment, sitting here listening to my voice, can you embrace yourself with unconditional love and acceptance? Is there any part of you resisting that? Any part of you screaming, no, I can't or else. They don't deserve it, I can't. Go even deeper into this. When did you stop loving yourself completely and unconditionally? Can you remember a time, perhaps a younger version of you where it all started? Visualize that younger you in front of you now. That younger you you've been hating and resisting. That younger you that might have just ruined everything. That younger you that should have known better, done better. That wasn't smart enough, that wasn't strong enough. Visualize that younger you you've been locking up inside. And seeing that younger you, visualize it in front of you now, in your mind's eye. Can you forgive it? Can you embrace it with unconditional love? Can you open yourself up to it and even listen to it? That younger you that might have felt alone, abandoned. Can you give that younger you what you need deep down inside? Can you welcome it back and embrace it with unconditional love and acceptance? Letting it know I'm here for you, I honor you, I welcome you back, I love you. For you are me. And just welcome any and all sensations, whatever surfaces, Allow yourself to feel it. Do not stuff it down. Honor it. For it is you. And having done so, bring your awareness back to the present you sitting here in this chair, listening to me. And I'll ask you again, seeing this present version of you, can you embrace yourself unconditionally? Accept yourself unconditionally. Are you still resisting you? 
What's so scary or bad about being you fully and unconditionally right here, right now? And let's get ready for a cycle here. The biggest one yet. Any and all sensations, tune into it and inhale for six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Big breath. Hold for three. Let it all go. Two, three, four, five, six. Hold for three again and breathe normally. And just take a moment to let things settle here. Take a moment to relax within once more. Perhaps relax your shoulders. Just see how relaxed you can get in this moment right now. Detach your tongue from the roof of your mouth. Let your jaw relax. Let every muscle in your face relax right now. Every muscle in your body, just let go. What's the most relaxed you can be? Relaxing your stomach, relaxing your shoulders, your neck, your eyes. Just let it all melt. Can you relax the top of your head? And can you relax even more? Wherever there's tension in the body, just let it melt, fade away. And just see how light you can be, how light you can get. So light, you can almost feel yourself floating up floating up beyond the body, letting go even more. And can you get even lighter? Is there still a part of you trying to hang on and control? Can you let go of that? Just loosen the grip you have on you. Getting lighter and lighter and even lighter so light you can feel yourself floating up higher and higher beyond the body, beyond the mind, floating up into this space that comes before everything. And even higher into this space of peace, letting go completely. This space of belonging. This space where all is good, all is well. Where you're exactly where you need to be, who you need to be. Where there are no requirements, there are no shoulds. Where you can just be. And take in that feeling of peace. That feeling of abundance. That feeling of love. The space that was there all along. Take a moment to reconnect with it now. To merge with it now. To surrender to it now. With every inhale, filling your body with light, warmth, strength, and love. And just take a moment to bask in this space completely. completely, letting this wash over you, reconnecting to this inner part of you, reconnecting to source and feeling the peace and love that comes with that. And can you merge with it even more? Completely now, feeling your body just glowing feeling strength and feeling that warmth rushing through you, reconnected to that love. Take a few more breaths, merging with it completely. And 
having merged with it, having reconnected to this sacred place within. I want you to take this with you and to slowly start bringing your awareness back into your body. Take this with you, bring it back into your body, bring in your awareness all the way back to the base of your spine where we first started. Your nose is down there once more. Your ears are down there. And let's do one final grounding breathing cycle from this position. Grounding you back in the body from the base of your spine, tune into it and inhale now. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold for three. Exhale for six, two, three, four, five, six. Hold for three again and breathe normally. Bring some awareness into your feet, feeling the floor beneath you. Up your legs, feeling the chair beneath you into your stomach, your chest, your shoulders, into your neck, your face, the top of your head, your entire body, feeling every part of you glowing with that light, feeling that warmth, feeling strengthened, reconnected to that love within. And we're slowly going to get ready to come back on the count of five. Slowly getting ready to come back to the present moment, to merge back into it. Reconnected to this space, feeling more whole, feeling more grounded, feeling more you. One, feel the floor beneath your feet. Two, the chair beneath you. Three, your entire body, every part of it. Four, with your eyes closed still, shift your awareness to the environment around you, sitting here listening to my voice, getting ready to come back to the present moment, ready to come back empowered, strengthened, ready to come back as more of you, ready to come back and have an amazing rest of your day rest of your week, rest of your month, rest of your year, rest of your life. Ah, ready to come back to the right here, right now, and open your eyes on the count of five. back with the present moment to feel what it's like to be a bit more of you perhaps wiggle your fingers wiggle your toes and maybe whenever you're ready at your own pace stretch it out and maybe stand up and give a high five or a hug to the person next to you welcoming each other back ah. 